Hey everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel Currency Insider. Please check back the latest update about Iraqi dinar. Intel guru Walking Stick recently shared an update from his Iraqi bank manager friend. Walking Stick mentioned that the bulletin boards, which are designed to be displayed in banks, had arrived. These boards will showcase images, descriptions, and explanations of the updated currency notes, helping to inform the public about the changes. He confirmed that the boards are intended for distribution across currency centers and banks to promote transparency and educate people on the new currency details. In response to a query, Walking Stick clarified that these boards had not yet been received at his banks in Dearborn, while he couldn't provide an exact timeline for their arrival. He emphasized his involvement in the process, stating that he had worked alongside key figures such as Iraqi Prime Minister Sudani, the central bank governor, representatives from the U.S. Treasury, the IMF, and the World Bank during the board's development. However, he confirmed he had not yet received the boards, hinting at international coordination in the initiative. Newshound Guru Samson shared two articles highlighting recent interactions between Iraq and the U.S. The first article reported that communication between Iraqi Prime Minister Sudani and U.S. President-elect Trump was described as highly positive, signaling promising relations between the two leaders. The second article revealed that Trump expressed a willingness to collaborate with Sudani and looked forward to meeting him soon. Intel Guru Frank 26 advised those holding substantial amounts of Iraqi dinar to keep their currency secure and not let it out of sight. He noted that smaller banks may need to send dinar to larger institutions for verification, but cautioned against simply handing it over. He recommended asking for the exact address of the verification center, such as a central or state bank in Columbus. Ohio, instead of sending the currency away. Frank 26 also suggested arranging for banks to come to one's location for verification, ensuring a secure process on their terms. Newshound guru Militiaman via POK reported that progress is moving quickly in Iraq with the new development road initiative, anticipating a significant influx of people and trade. He found it noteworthy that within just five days, Iraq's central bank had sold over a billion dollars, highlighting a move to eliminate parallel and black markets for the dollar. This is seen as an important step. As Iraq adjusts the real effective exchange rate, rear, the dinar is expected to strengthen beyond the value of the dollar, a goal Prime Minister al-Sudani has consistently emphasized. This critical development is highly anticipated by both investors and citizens.